Welcome back to Jessup Cellars. Uh, today we're tasting our 2009 Napa Valley Chardonnay. God, beautiful nose. Uh, some of the, the oak influence you expect from a traditional California Chardonnay, uh, toasted vanilla, a touch of hazelnut, kind of a lemon curd, sort of a creamier lemon, uh, with some, some sharper citrus aspects as well. Um, but not overblown. It doesn't have that stick of butter in a two by four character that uh, is uh, sort of notorious amongst California Chardonnays. It's a little, little more balance. Um, <sighs> God, beautiful. Now, on the palate, the, those citrus flavors carry through with a little touch of green apple as well. So kind of a lemon lime, green apple, a little bit of pineapple. It ventures into the tropical flavors just a touch. Um, there's a little a, a hint of almost an orange blossom character, a little floral note to it as well. How ah, beautiful. This is uh, good with food, good without as well. I think you can go either way with this wine. Uh, my, my favorite pairing with this, uh, actually beautiful, one of my favorite Jessup food and wine pairings, period, is uh, bacon wrapped scallops. Uh, start with a little olive oil, a little bit of butter in your pan, and then just a splash of this Chardonnay. Sear your scallops uh, in, the, in the Chardonnay, put them over a bed of mixed greens, and then serve the wine with them. Just a perfect pairing back and forth. And, you know, from start of preparation to on the table, you're dealing with about 10 minutes total, so one of my favorite entertaining options. Um, this is a wine that's probably best consumed relatively young, uh, you know, within the first two to three years, but it will hang out for a little bit if that's your, uh, if that's your style. Just beautiful. Great with food, great without. Come and enjoy a glass with us today. Thanks.